If you're feeling kind of bored, I got 10 trivia questions on board games. Let's get it. What is up and welcome to another episode of No Chit Chat Trivia, the trivia podcast with less talk and more trivia. Something that my family always does around the holidays is play board games, so with board games on the mind, I thought we'd do an episode on them. So let's jump into it and have some fun. Our first question is, Miss Scarlet with a lead pipe in the ballroom is a sentence you might hear at the end of what classic board game? Miss Scarlet with a lead pipe in the ballroom is a sentence you might hear at the end of what classic board game? Question number two, Lord Licorice, Princess Lolly, and Mr. Mint are characters that can be found in what children's board game? Lord Licorice, Princess Lolly, and Mr. Mint are characters that can be found in what children's board game? Number three, in a game of Yahtzee, what is a Yahtzee? In a game of Yahtzee, what is a Yahtzee? Question number four, what popular team board game includes categories such as Data Head, Word Worm, and Creative Cat? What popular team board game includes categories such as Data Head, Word Worm, and Creative Cat? Number 5. Salesperson, Athlete, Computer Designer, and Doctor are some of the careers you may obtain in what board game? Salesperson, athlete, computer designer, and doctor are some of the careers you may obtain in what board game? Halfway through our questions on board games, question number six, one of the first mass-produced three-dimensional board games, what game involves collecting cheese tokens and being the last player to not be captured? One of the first mass-produced three-dimensional board games, what game involves collecting cheese tokens and being the last player to not be captured? Number seven, in a game of Battleship, how many ships does each side start with? In a game of Battleship, how many ships does each side start with? Question number eight, in Trivial Pursuit, what two colors represent the categories of entertainment and history? In Trivial Pursuit, what two colors represent the categories of entertainment and history? Number nine, what board game's tagline is, quote, the classic game of sweet revenge? What board game's tagline is, quote, the classic game of sweet revenge? And question number 10. On a standard Monopoly board, what are the names of the three orange properties? On a standard Monopoly board, what are the names of the three orange properties? If you pass go, be sure to collect $200 and stick around for our answers. Welcome back. Our first question was, Miss Scarlet with a lead pipe in the ballroom is a sentence you might hear at the end of what classic board game? That classic board game would be Clue. Clue. And for those not in North America, it is known as Cluedo. Number two, Lord Licorice, Princess Lolly, and Mr. Mint are characters that can be found in what children's board game? That children's board game would be Candyland. Candyland, 
yummy. Question number three, in a game of Yahtzee, what is a Yahtzee? A Yahtzee occurs when all five dice are the same number. When all five dice are the same number. Number four, what popular team board game includes categories such as Data Head, Word Worm, and Creative Cat? I've always loved this game. It is super fun. It is Cranium. Cranium. Question number five, salesperson, athlete, computer designer, and doctor are some of the careers you may obtain in what board game? You may get one of those careers in the game of life. The game of life. Number six, one of the first mass produced three dimensional board games. What game involves collecting cheese tokens and being the last player to not be captured? Maybe the cheese tokens gave it away. That game is Mouse Trap. Mouse Trap. Question number seven. In a game of Battleship, how many ships does each side start with? Each player starts with a carrier that takes five shots to defeat, a battleship that takes four, cruiser and submarine ships that each take three, and the elusive destroyer that takes two. So a total of five ships. Five. Number eight, in Trivial Pursuit, what two colors represent the categories of entertainment and history? In Trivial Pursuit, entertainment is pink and history is yellow. Pink and yellow. Question number nine, what board game's tagline is, quote, the classic game of sweet revenge? The classic game of sweet revenge is sorry. Sorry. And our last question was, on a standard Monopoly board, what are the names of the three orange properties? The three orange properties you would need to make a Monopoly are St. James Place, Tennessee Avenue, and New York Avenue. St. James Place, Tennessee Avenue, and New York Avenue. I hope you all had a good time answering those questions on board games. Maybe it even inspired some of you to dust off one of those classic games and play with some family and friends tonight. All right, until next time, let's remember to be kind to each other. Bye, guys. Bye.